Okay, I made it up to the tip top of the Space Needle. I'm like nervous laughing because I'm actually a little scared of heights and this is very, very high up, but we're getting a behind the scenes look of what's going on for the New Year's celebration. Super, super cool. There's drones, there's a bunch of new stuff. Um, so let's check out the view. Yeah, I think the unique thing here is that it's going to be pyrotechnics, lighting, drones, and the music all choreographed for one experience. That's pretty special when you look at uh, shows around the world, especially because the Space Needle is already one of the world's largest structurally launched firework shows without any of those other elements. So you add in the music, the lighting, the drones, and it sort of takes it to that next level that makes us completely unique in the world. This year marks the first in-person New Year's at the Needle celebration since 2019, featuring a new element, hundreds of drones. Sky Elements, a Texas-based drone light show provider, displayed the light formations in the sky. Insider tip, don't tell anybody, YouTube. Uh, we would say that probably our best view is gonna be over towards Climate Pledge Arena. Uh, the grass fields there next to the uh, fountain, International Fountain, will probably be about your best spot to see the majority of the show. Ta-da! We're so excited to have the party back right at the foot of the Space Needle. It's our 31st New Year's at the Needle which means we're entering our fourth decade of the celebration, which is wild. There's some cool drone formations that are very Seattle that you're gonna see as part of it. Um, and just all throughout, I think it's gonna be nonstop 10 minutes of just eye-popping uh, effects and music. The drones flew between 200 and 600 feet off the ground. The music with the show featured the biggest moments in the past year. Randy, you are the best. If you ever want to know what is going on in Seattle, this is your guy, okay? All things Space Needle, so fun. I would not be out here freezing, learning about the behind the scenes if it wasn't for Randy. So I'm really excited. And let's just show you a montage of what you might have missed on New Year's. Cheers to 2023.